It's you. Let's go out to play, Daddy. Her name is Eleanor, and she is mine. Now, kneel, please. Remove your helmet. Now, take the pistol. Place it against your head.
My husband is such a perfect idiot. Throws away all his spending money on gene tonics to affect a look of physical fitness. So he'll have an excuse to sit on his rear all day listening to radio serials. Steven, I tell him, you want to be fit? Come swim laps with me, the old-fashioned way. It's your mind that's atrophying. Maybe I'll start sneaking some brain boost into his daily regimen. Father! sleeping for such a long time and Eleanor has missed you. Find her and you'll be all better. Valley of the shadow of death. Oh long, so long. Who I heard that. Ah! 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 Nothing. Last, a signal. You, who are bringing this dead city to life, listen. My name, it is Tannenbaum. I know who you are, and I am in much need of your help. Please, find me in the Atlantic Express train station. Taste of Adam in weeks. I don't die. This is Dr. Sophia Lamb with a message for the people. Remember, you are not alone. Think of me not as leader. I am back in rapture after so many years. The little ones I rescued are grown up. And think of me no more. After what I once did to them, it was a joy to be forgotten. But now, all around the world, children vanish by the sea, kidnapped. And so I return, in fear of what I already know. Someone is making new little ones, continuing my work, my sins. Even if I am to die for it, I must stop.
In that suit, even the ocean cannot harm you. This is good. But rapture is the death of many great men. Alone, you will not last long. You can still reach the train station. Find me there.
Ah, Herr Delta. You arrive as the little one said you would. Come upstairs to the ticket booth, and I will offer what I know of you. Now most who survive are like this. Splicers. They're drug addicts. Vicious animals. Sophia Lamb. Andrew Ryan is dead, but the tyrant dwells within us all. Remember, we reject the gene. We reject the self. We reject the tyrant. Now you know of the enemy we share, Sophia Lamb. The camera in your helmet allows me to watch through your eyes and help you to fight her. <laughs> Careful, security cameras belong to Lamb. But, if you are clever, they can be made to serve you. Who's
It's me, Eleanor. I know you're awake in there. I can feel it. Mother won't be able to... to toy with you like that ever again. This plasmid is for you. If I'm right, you can use it now. Please, find me. not black, Dr. Lamb. Down is not up, and straw is not gold. Look around you. Rapture is no miracle. It is a product of reason. Impossible unless one and one are two, and A equates to A. And yet, alone, each man is a prisoner to bias, dream, delusion, or the pain of a phantom limb. To one man, they are as real as rain. Reality is consensus, and the people are losing faith. Take a walk, Andrew. It is raining in rapture, and you have simply chosen not to notice. is using the splicers against you. Most big daddies are like her slaves, guarding the little ones. But someone has awakened you.
I know of your bond with Eleanor Delta. To save yourself, you will come for her. But Eleanor has a destiny, one you cannot share. There is no place for you in paradise. <laughs> what the children tell me. You are a very old big daddy, bonded for life to a single little one. When you are apart for too long, your body begins to shut down like a coma. As long as the girl is in the rapture, you are trapped here as well. The name of your little one is Eleanor Lamb, daughter of Sophia. She is kept at Fontaine Futuristics on the other side of the city. You must go there and save her before it is too late. Su Chong's death was a nasty blow to the Protector program, but I'm gradually settling into his role, picking up the slack that his carelessness left behind. We are gaining steam again, but I'm not satisfied. Yes, the Big Daddy defends the girl, but he is programmed only for the fight. 
like a sheepdog who wanders off unless a wolf is tearing at his flock. When no aggressor is present, he regards his little sister as he might a common houseplant. We need something more, something stronger, an unbreakable physiological bond. Turn to rescue them. If I do not, more children will die for my sins, and the rapture nightmare it will repeat forever. Now, we must talk. Citizens, Citizens of rapture. rapture. This, this is, subject is Subject Delta. Delta. Behind, Behind that, that mask, mask hides an enemy, enemy of, the of the people, people. Without, without soul, soul or, or sympathy. sympathy. It, it is, is a beast, beast apart, apart, and as, as family. family we must tear out its jaw and drive it back into the sea. Lem will take this place apart to find you. Please hold back the splicers until we escape. Thank you. Now I must leave you, and I am sorry for this, but there are others I must help before the city drowns. This man Sinclair, he is an ally, and will guide you to Eleanor. Goodbye, Herr Delta, and good luck. Well, look at you. A bona fide knight in armor, complete with iron horse. The name's Augustus Sinclair Sport. Esquire. Old Tannenbaum and I share an interest in the old Fontaine building, the very same place you'll find Eleanor Lamb. I think you and I can do business. Take the train to Ryan Amusements. I'll see you shortly.
Whoa there. Now better apply the brakes unless you're aiming to dash yourself against that glacier up ahead. As you can see, Chief, the station here is iced over. To reach Eleanor Lamb at Fontaine headquarters, we'll have to clear the way. Now, in order to melt that ice, you'll need a plasmid like a handful of hellfire. We used to sell a fine old product called Incinerate in the amusement park up yonder. Go on and find a way in. I've already been on all the rides. Eleanor is progressing brilliantly. My physical participation in her birth was minimized, of course. It is vital that I am unhindered by nature's crude bias. I will be, above all, her intellectual progenitor, loyal not to her, but to the people she will ultimately save. But I admit, it is with some measure of pride that I review her marks in standard intelligence tests. As an agent of our beliefs, she may surpass even me. Welcome to the Circus of Value! You're a rare old model, son. Alpha series, I believe. Now, Rapture's full of scientific wonderments just like you. And if we can sell them to the world at my price, well, curing your condition ought to be a cakewalk. Once we find Eleanor, the sky's the limit. I was hired to engineer a park the likes of which no man has seen. Now all I do is watch over it like a grizzled sheepdog. My first line of mechanical puppets made the children here cool with wonder. But Ryan thought my vision was immature. Antiquated, he said. This place could have been something magical. But instead, he turned it into a school. No, a cathedral. Dedicated to himself. <laughs> Jim Dandy, that'll get you in the park. But buying incinerate's gonna cost Adam. It's a sort of genetic goo that lets you rewrite whatever God gave you. The little sisters carry the stuff, as you may recall, so you'll need to locate one. I heard whispering near the El Dorado Lounge. Have a look. Stupid motor. My lantern's condition is far beyond... <laughs> Listen up! Clappers! Get yourself hit! No fuck-ups this time! Daddy's home! Take aim! Fire! Unbeliever! That jump will ruin the running out of me! Oh my god! Father! Oh my god! 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 Oh my god!
Welcome to Ryan Amusements. Please enjoy the park. Refitted for heavy construction, the Olympian returns with a new cargo. A state-of-the-art submersible platform. Your kind ain't welcome here. Where are you going? I still serve. Ridiculous. Ridiculous. This is Used to be there was no margin in running the gift shop. I couldn't hardly sell off this tourist crap for a penny more than the cost of manufacture. Then I met a street shooter named Sinclair. He laid a sweet deal on me. He says he's got some hard luck folks down at Popper's Shop to whip up this junk at half the cost I used to pay. Yeah, I had to pick a needle.